a holiday, the official end of the summer beach season. But tell that to the thousands flocking to the surf and sand today. People who stuck around treat it to just a near perfect day at the beach. And our Hal Sherrick was there. He's joining us live from Gulf Shores and Hal. Still a ton of people out there, right? Yeah, there were. It wasn't too bad, though. A lot of folks decided to use their holiday driving home after a long weekend at the Gulf, but not everyone. There were still plenty of folks who came out to the beach to squeeze all they could out of this holiday. Labor Day, known as the unofficial bookend to the summer tourist season, is a day a lot of locals hit the beach as tourists head home. You couldn't help but notice the mass exodus on the drive down. Traffic. But thank goodness it's mainly going the other way, but that's a good thing. The Gulf waters were inviting with just a gentle shore break washing up on the beach. It offered visitors a nice relief from the summer heat. Back on the beach, there was plenty of room to spread out and enjoy. Today is much more open space. We're closer to the water and just less crowded. Those fortunate enough to come were grateful the weather cooperated. With the weather being so crazy this year, um, but uh, we were thankful that it <laughs> God gave us a gorgeous day. We're so glad it's sunny and we didn't have one drop of rain. Right. Yeah, the water temperature is perfect. As summer winds down, lifeguard staffing will as well. Beach safety officials tell me the weekend's been uneventful with just a handful of heat related calls. Beginning this week, most lifeguard stands will be brought in and areas will be patrolled by vehicles. So what does that mean for beachgoers? Uh, what, what would your message be to them given that that, that that's going on. The main thing is to still call 911, um, even though they may not see us directly, but they are in the area. So to call 911, that way we can respond as fast as possible. Folks just couldn't have asked for really a better beach day than what they got today. Now, in my opinion, some of the best beach days are yet to come. September, October kind of starts to cool off. It's still pleasant. The water still feels great. And the crowds aren't here, so be sure to get ready to enjoy those. Reporting live here in Gulf Shores, Hal Sherrick, Fox 10 News. All right.